Hey guys, it's me, RoryC123, and today, instead of doing a Spongebob review, I thought, hmm, what other show should I, uh, review? And I thought, why not Wallace and Gromit? So this is my worst to best Wallace and Gromit shorts. So I've made some special slides. So, number four, the worst being a close shave. Now, I don't hate any of these shorts, I just think this one's... Well, the least good. It's very filler type show. Like, well, it's very filler y. Like, there's nothing going on. It, sure, it's Wallace's first romance, but like, the only thing this episode sparked was the spin off, Sean the Sheep. Now, I don't have any slides for the other episodes, so I'm just gonna have to go into these without special slides. So, for number. Three, we have a grand day out. Now, a grand day out isn't your... Well, it was the first Wallace and Gromit short that little baby Rory saw. And, yeah, I do like this episode, this short, but if they... It's not like Wallace and Gromit developed the comedy in their first episode. No, that's coming later. And this episode doesn't really... Well, yes, the story's amazing, and yes, I love that, like the villain in the story, the, like, what is this guy, like, a TV or something? I don't really know, but he's cool. Number two, A Matter of Loaf and Death. Now, this one is very good. It's very funny. Paella is probably up there with my favourite villains of t television. And this, uh, this one is probably the most funny funny out of them all but it has the best story it's about it's after the movie when they were anti-pesto they're now the bakery people and yeah it's good i like the story and to be honest the dog um poodles is her name i think um she's very scared in the short she's very scared and bum ba da bum ba bum the only one that I haven't talked about is number one, The Wrong Trousers. What can I say about this one that hasn't been said a million times? I love the story. Feathers McGrock is the best thing ever. He's the best villain. He's just like Eddie, a penguin. He's, he's amazing. He's great. And the train scene, oh my god, the train scene was just phenomenal. Like what, like Gromit putting down all the tracks, the guy has a plumbing gun, like god. And like, it's just so good. And how he's, and how he tricks naive Wallace into making him go into his house and try to pay rent. It's just amazing. The story is great. And yeah, it, there's no filler in this. So if I had to rate them all out of five, the wrong trousers number is a five out of five. Uh, a matter of loaf and death is a five out of five. A grand day out is a four out of five, and a close shave is by two out of five. So yeah, that's it. Hopefully you agree with me. I don't know if you do, but if you do, yeah, thanks. Also shout out to Kill Mikey Fifty One and I Mean God Fifty Four. Those guys are my friends and they're amazing. So, 